What is going on guys? Today I want to show you my newest team to do crypt. Yeah, this team is absolutely busted in the crypt and I mean absolutely busted. You know, I have zero issues clearing everything with this team. And now the thing is, uh, the reason why this team is so good in the crypt is because usually if you have just started the game, you won't have a lot of high fusion characters. You're going to have one really good high fusion character, in my case it's Classic Scorpion, and two kind of okay characters. I have also Piercing Melina and, um, you know, um, Turn the God Radiant, but I don't really use them to carry me in Crypt. The guy who carries me all the time is Classic Scorpion because he's that good. However, uh, I have a lot of issues, and I mean a lot of issues if I have to face a lot of modifiers and certain characters. For instance, if I'm playing Classic Scorpion, uh, or let's say any other, let's say that you're building a team with your strongest uh, character and two other golds or diamonds at the fusion zero, level five, that just give you good bonuses. Uh, you will hate your life if you have to face Aftershock Tremor, and this is the case for me. I absolutely despise facing Aftershock Tremor, and I absolutely despise facing um, like a battle with a modifier of balance. However, this team has no issues about it whatsoever. First thing first, we're starting with Slasher Jason, who has the varmint like he had. So the plan is you tag him out immediately. And the guy who tags him gains 10 seconds of shield. And on top of everything, he's going to also heal. Look at this, 5.5 regeneration. So he tags out and the other guy starts healing. How busted is that? And uh, you are going to ask why has such Jason, because if they kill him, that's not a big deal. He can come back twice and he can stall time. So he's perfect for all balance. And there is Unstoppable Jason, level 14, so this guy doesn't really do a lot of damage. However, he has the Midnight Stalker Curse, it dropped from the Crypt on my beginner account. And that's absolutely crazy. And look at this, under 25% health, Jason applies stun on the opponent and enter Frenzy for 5 seconds while it is active, he gains invulnerability. So in a way, if we can buy this, together with the fact that this Jason also comes to life once, there we go, we have two Jasons that can come back to life twice, which makes this team unkillable. And in Hard Tower and Hard Crypt, there isn't really a lot of cases where the enemy team is going to have brutality set, so all we need to be aware of is the death mark. Death mark is going to be a problem. Anyways, uh, we are about to finish Hard Crypt, so let me just demonstrate how busted this team is. Of course, against bosses, the two Jasons won't be doing a lot, but you have Classic Scorpion to kill them all. My Classic Scorpion is also, always, also, also, almost maxed out. Oh, that's not good. Alright, anyways, doesn't matter. I hope he's not going to evade the second one. He didn't. Oh, he's going to... He's going to get... He's going to get bleed, so that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Okay, he goes down, I guess. This guy comes. He's going to eat the spear. And at this point, you know, I can even take my time and heal my scorpion. And how I'm going to do that, I'm going to tag to Slash Jason. Uh, and I'm going to apply bleed to this guy. And then I'm going to apply a second bleed to this guy. Remember that the bleed is going to be doing more damage if you try hard on the minigame. It's weird, but this is the way it works. I'm going to do another bleed. I hope this guy doesn't really, uh, you know, reflect it back to me. All right, you know what? I'm going to make him do this. He's not going to, he's not going to snare me because he's going to kill me instead. I'm perfectly, perfectly fine with that. I'm going to do another bleed to this guy. <laughs> oh, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. I can take all the punishment. No, don't, don't do that to me. Don't freeze on me. Don't crash on me. You can freeze, but don't crash. Unfreeze. Unfreeze now. Come on. I don't even... I don't know if I have the souls to, to reset my team. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, sometimes sometimes it does that and it's horrible. I don't know. Probably the, the problem is the emulator. It's not necessary the game. Because my phone never freezes like this. It only freezes on emulator. So I guess, uh, yeah, it's emulator fault. Alright, kill him. Oh, my God. It doesn't matter. I have plenty of opportunities. Okay. I'm going to do another... Special one. And uh, you know what? I want to make this guy. I want to kill this guy using this Jason. How busted is going to be, huh? Special two? Uh, it's not going to be enough, but the Blitz is going to kill him, so it's fine. Please, do something to me. Do something to me. Alright, anyways, he goes down. So you can see how safe this team is with this particular composition. If you don't have Classic Scorpion, that's fine. You can use your strongest gold that usually is scaring your account or your strongest diamond. But at the end of the day, uh, the truth of the matter is that it is almost impossible to lose. Your main guy is protected by shield and regeneration, and there are two auxiliary guys that almost cannot die because they are that, that strong. That's absolutely busted. Alright, another battle. Power Surge. 
this is not going to be difficult at all, but still I, I hate myself that I already beat the off-balance fight. They were so easy, absolutely, extremely easy. Anyways, I'm going to attack the classic squirt and I do what I usually do. I'm going to get a special one, I'm going to wreck everybody. And I have a shield, I have a regeneration, so I'm chilling. Uh, and this regeneration is going to get me back to 100, but that's perfectly fine. Because what I'm going to do now uh, is I'm going to kill this guy. Okay, he's going to tag out, I'm going to tag him back in, I'm going to kill him, and then I'm going to tag to... Oh, he reflected it! Oh, I just wanted to heal, but this guy's not going to let me do that. Anyways, I'm going to tag to Slash Jason, and I really don't mind this tribal killing my Slash Jason. In fact, this is going to give me more power, so that's perfectly fine. Alright, bam, bam. Oh, it was it was a little bit short. Anyways. Oh, 1% one, 1 health, that's always useful. Another special one to this guy. He's going down after this one, and then this guy comes, another special one. And I'm going to attack now to Jason. Again, I want to waste some time so that I can come back uh, with uh, Scorpion, gain shield and regeneration so that the next fight the Scorpion will have more health. Okay, I'm not even going to try hard at the minigame, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, he's going to kill me. Actually, he will try, but he will fail. Alright, let's attack to Scorpion. And now, let's wait. He's not going to do a lot of damage to us, so we can just wait and heal in the process. That's perfectly fine. Regeneration is going to expire now. Alright, special one, kill. Super, super overpowered um, setup. Like, crazy good. Again, it requires Fusion Zero uh, blue pieces and one uh, epic that can drop in the crypt. And this is, I was looking on the epic, it dropped in the crypt and I managed to build it. All right, let's see whether I will find an off balance fight. I haven't explored the right side of the crypt. Okay, it seems that there are two or three battles left before the boss fight. Uh, dampening. All right, it's okay. All right. Uh, this is Dark Raiden. A lot of people claim that Dark Raiden counters MK11 Scorpion and Classic Scorpion, but this is simply not true. It is true that he isn't the best matchup, but definitely he's not a counter because, especially if your MK11 Scorpion is like distant fusion, fusion 4, fusion 5, he's going to one shot. Dark Raiden. Dark Raiden has the lowest stats, one of the lowest stats in the game. Look at this. I don't even have to use special attacks, even though if I wanted to, I could. But there is no point. I'm going to use it now. He's going to come back. That's perfectly fine. Oh, he didn't because. Why he didn't come back? I had that mark on him, I never noticed. Anyways, I'm going to run another special one. He's going to be another very easy W. I don't think this team can has anything else to offer. Okay, can I have that mark now, please, kind sir? The death mark, please. Alright, anyways, I think that uh, this should be enough. I think that this should be enough. The Blitz is going to kill him while my slash JSON animation is on. Yeah. It, it kind of was enough, but it kind of wasn't, because this guy got re resurrected. It's okay, though. I'm going to kill him now. I'm going to do special one, and one punch. Bam. Dead. And I have shield, and I'm full HP, again. And I have two shield. You know, the Varmin Slicky Hat, guys, is absolutely busted at low fusion. And I just I just realized I'm transparent for some reason. Let me fix myself. So what I was saying, the Varmin Slicky Hat is... Totally, totally busted. It's absolutely and really busted. Can I be like this? Oh my god. You no, know, I have this issue because uh, my setup is a little bit angled and I can and my, my green screen had to be angled. And I have this, this issue that sometimes the light dispersion isn't really equal everywhere. That's why sometimes there is some kind of a gray area right there, which is unfortunate. But there's nothing I can do, really. This is my room. I have no other place where to place the green screen. I don't want to put it in the living room. This will never happen. So, because I don't I have to, like, move my PC to the living room, which, again, not really good. And my bedroom, I don't have that much space. Anyways, I hope you're going to forgive me. Alright, so uh, this is going to be tricky because uh, what needs to happen is I need to kill Elder God Kanshi pretty fast. Uh, if I don't kill him fast, then what needs to happen is I will be able to uh, tag back out to Sasha Jason because I don't want my... Uh, did he... I believe he stole my buffs? At least he definitely stole my regeneration, which is weird, but anyways. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to throw another special one. Then I'm going to attack uh, to slash Jason. Reason being, I don't want my uh, Jason, not my Jason, sorry. I don't want my uh, Scorpion to get killed by Classic Raiden. If Classic Raiden attacks him now, he'll most probably execute my Scorpion. I didn't mean this Raiden, but uh, I, don't, I don't actually... No! Okay, that's, that's, that's bad. Actually, that's quite good. You know what? That's quite good. Okay, 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 okay that, that's perfect. No, that's not perfect. Oh my god, I'm frostbitten! How he... Oh, he has this epic piece that frostbites. I just realized. Ah, oh, it's so bad! Tell me that I'm going to survive this. Tell me that I'm going to survive this. Oh my god, no, my classic scorpion is out! Oh, I just said this is the... 
safest team on the planet and I'm going to lose. Oh my god. Okay, I still have chance, but it's super low. The, my entire chance is my slash Jason beating them to death. Imagine if I lose this. That's going to be absolutely crazy. Okay. <sighs> Apparently he's not going to be kill uh, not be able to kill me, but still. Hmm. Okay. <sighs> ah, come on! Tag the freak out! What is wrong with this classic score? Uh, whatever. Wow. I didn't see the equipment. And to be honest with you guys, I never imagined ever that I'm going to lose a battle uh, with this team. It's just, it just almost impossible to lose. Okay, he did special too. Which is kind of okay. Now, I need to do special one. Because I, did, I need to, uh, like, stall some time, then tag to the other Jason. Okay. Injustice to Raiden is full HP, man. I don't know where I can beat that. I mean, I can come back, revive everybody and just destroy them, but still, wow, that was crazy. I didn't expect that. It's never actually happened to me before uh, to lose a battle like this. I mean, uh, if I lose a battle, it'd be something like, oh, what is the, even the modifier of this fight? Like, power search. Okay, I totally didn't pay attention to the modifier. Okay, I'm dead. Like, I have to, I have to quit and revive my entire team. And I'm going to revive, I'm going to kill him. Seriously, I'm going to kill all of them. Right now, I'm totally pissed. I'm going to kill him. I'm just going to kill him. Like this special tool of Injustice Raiden was super, super bad. Anyways, let's revive. Okay, I can definitely revive because I have the revive stone and I'm going to buy another one. It's it's fine. I'm going to buy one. 50 souls, it's 50 souls, okay. Uh, 50 souls, it's fine. If I had to spend 150, I'd say no, not going to do that. But I just want to get, uh, uh, I just need a rematch against this team because uh, the way I lost was crazy. You know what I'm going to do now? You know, to make sure that I'm going to win, uh, first I'm going to heal everybody, and then I will make sure, you know what, if I increase the, the, the thing is a large life stone, it's not really worth, uh, however small life stone it is 100% worth, so I'm going to do this, alright, I think like this is fine, like scorpion is going to be okay, <laughs> I mean definitely, I mean if I, if I uh, quit now, it's not really a big deal, but I want to really beat this team so bad, like what is, the gear of Injustice Raiden. What is the gear of Injustice Raiden? Yeah, he has a Shinto of the North. Okay. Alright. Now, tag to Classic Scorpion immediately, kill the guy, and then make sure that you have a uh, shield so that you can survive the, the X-Ray, if they have X-Ray well. It is not an easy fight. And he stole my regeneration. It's okay, I don't need a regeneration at this point, so... It's fine. Okay. Now what I'm going to do uh, is... I'm going to throw another spear. Okay. Okay, this time we had this uh, Raiden, which is cool, which is absolutely super cool. So what I'm going to do is, for a moment I thought this guy died. So I'm going to do is X-Ray, so I can set the entire enemy team on fire. I'm sorry, so I can set them, uh, make them bleed. And then I'm going to kill this Raiden, and then I win. Ah, okay, this one, this one's bad. I totally underestimated the team, never sold the equipment, and I got wrecked. And to be honest with you, this, uh, this, uh, the thing that they applied to me, uh, the frostbite was horrible. I never expected that, and it destroyed me. If uh, the frostbite wasn't applied to my classic scorpion, I would have won that in the previous fight. But the frostbite was too much to handle. Uh, anyways, so, like, a lesson learned, you can lose even with this fight if you don't pay attention. Uh, if, I mean, with this uh, team if you don't pay attention. And the 10 uh, consumables waste on classic scorpion, or actually totally wasted, as I mentioned already. <laughs> there was no point, because I don't think that they ever hit me uh, on the second fight. Anyways, boss fights, thank you very much, it's going to be an easy one. If they don't have a Kabao and MK11 Jade, usually it's an easy one. Also, Sub-Zero is annoying. Out of this team, only I would say that um, uh, Rain is annoying, because he does the thing, you know, he... Oh, it is a one for all. It doesn't matter, I'm going to just punch him to that, it's perfectly fine. Plus, if it's one for all, uh, the enemy Lucian cannot really power drain anything, so <laughs> I'm okay with that. Uh, okay, can I have some power to my Scorpion if possible? I really, really appreciate that. Not that I cannot beat it without it, but still. Okay, attack to this guy. Uh, just going to the special one. They're immune to bleed, so just wasting some time. Okay, I did some damage, I guess. That's not bad. Okay. Okay, just go they're going to waste the oh and Lucane tags. That's that's that was very overpowered attack, my friend. Okay. Alright. I just need once to get power to classic scorpion if possible. 
I hate one for all. I mean, one for all is still beatable, but uh, off balance is horrible. I absolutely despise off, ba off balance. Okay, can I have? That's so. That's so annoying. So far, I never got a single time. Like one minute is passed, not a single power boost to my scorpion. And again, I'm an adjacent. Okay. I mean, I cannot, I cannot beat them like in one minute if I cannot do spe special attacks. At least one special attack. I mean, game, let me do one special attack. Like one special attack, please. Please, what the hell? They're doing that on purpose. It is the game is absolutely doing that on purpose. Thank God that I blocked that. At least I, I think I can kill J. Uh, and the thing is, uh, if I if I time out, that's fine because I'm going to kill the next attempt. Boom. Okay. Kill him. Oh, I knew this is going to happen. I knew this is going to happen. Hmm. Finally! Thank you very much. Thank you very much. This is what I need. This is what I need. And now, uh, so this means basically that uh, I need to do that because otherwise he'll kill my Jason. I don't want this to happen. I have 30 seconds left on the clock. But even if I time out, that's fine. That's perfectly fine if I time out because I can just finish them off on the next attempt. He's going to do special two on the shield, on the regeneration. It's not going to do a lot. Uh, anyways, I'm going to kill Raiden because he's annoying. Okay, Raiden dies. Okay. Okay, special one. Uh, just to stall some time. Okay, I'm going to attack now to Scorpion. who's going to have all the defensive buffs in the world. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't have, it just it gave power to my scorpion once in the entire match. It gave me power once in the entire match. And of course if my Jasons were higher fusion I wouldn't have any issues, but since they are low fusion and low levels, still though I can make the, the fight easily on the second attempt, so this is the thing I'm going to do that. But there is no penalties, you don't have to spend any souls, so you just do the fight and finish it off. As long as you don't lose any characters. Again, this team is super, super difficult to lose characters. The, as you saw, the only way that you can lose if your classic scorpion dies, like it happened in the previous fight. If your classic scorpion lives, there's no there's no point. There is no way to lose. Alright, you know what? I'm going to do this. <laughs> oh, pure soul. You're going to get wrecked right now. Okay. Talk to scorpion. Talk to scorpion immediately. Yes, thank you very much. I don't think that um, Rain has anything left. He's going to die. Nothing he can do. 42 per uh, thousand health. 31. Like one combo literally takes away about 10 thousand health. So I just need to do two combos, and he's dead. All right, guys. A crypt done, with the with the exception for this annoying fight where I messed up. It was an easy breezy well walk in the park, and now I hope you're going to get something good. Uh, and I didn't. Anyways, 1,270 hearts, I'm going to take it, which means that very, very soon I will be buying the only thing that I'll be buying from the store, the General Father Gun, which is super, super useful, more or less on any character, especially uh, in the Cold Tower, the Cold War Tower, whatever way that it's going to be named uh, in the next update. If it comes in the next update, I don't know. But, uh, you know, we have the Cold Team, so I guess they're going to rename the tower as well. I don't know if it's going to be the Cold Tower, it's like I don't I'm against the whole renaming of things like it was okay cold war anyways see you next time guys take care perfect